Okay, done with breakfast. Gonna go check out of the hotel, and then we're gonna go hike around the Grand Cora. The Buddhists go around the whole monastery area and pray. There's a small one, which is like three kilometers, and there's a big one, which goes all the way up the mountain, onto the ridge, and across, and back down. We're gonna try that one. And we only have four hours left here before we have to go and catch the bus back to Lanzhou. So we have to hike fast. Let's go. My mom's checking out the Tibetan medicine guru monk. Call 150-14 for your free consultation. Wow, I just get that. They are surprised. They're really surprised that he can speak Tibetan. I speak Tibetan, that's it. So this is a Tibetan debate. I really don't know. So maybe if we come back and you ask, will it different? Maybe. We'll look. Yeah, maybe. What I remember is in front of the monastery, they had they had the two groups, and two people would go in the middle, Delegates and they would the give their their speech, and then someone else would come and give their speech, and then. They'd go back. But is it like debate club and you can win? I don't know. But then the, That's or, a good or question. Is it, is it, let's just talk about it. I was I asking know. the monk friend this yesterday actually. Apparently there's ranking. So you can go up in the rankings and down in the rankings. Oh, you get. Oh, that's interesting. Um, you know, if you're like really high in the rankings, then you're going to be, you know, well known. Master, master debater. 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 So we got a little bit lost, we couldn't find the path to the upper Kora. So this kind Tibetan guy is going to help us find the right path. During the uh, special uh, special festival, all the ceremony to all, all the monks, all, all the monks will go the way oh. uh, to to circle the to circle the temple. Interesting. Uh. Nice. Carrying the drone. I know it's you gonna be worth it. it. I know it's gonna be worth it. Definitely. It's gonna be worth it. Let me take the drone. Let me, let me carry it. Maybe. So it's too warm in your jacket. No, it's okay. It. Well, we're at the first stop. The first prayer flag. We made it to the first one. We have two hours to get back to our hotel. We're gonna hike along the ridge here overlooking the city. Two hours guys, we can do it. Good hike. 
That was, that was cold, yeah, but it's a lot shorter than I thought it would be, which is awesome. So we'll make it in time for the bus. And look, they're planting trees here. It's a hairy swine? It's a pig. I've never seen a hairy swine before. I love this kid's haircut. Wow. I remember... <laughs> we met our friends from the prayer caves yesterday. They were so nice. They're really friendly. Yeah. They just chill on the corner. No, that Chinese couple, they were so nice. They, when we were about to give up yesterday, they yelled at us and from across the way, they were ahead of us on the path and shouted to us from way far out to tell us we were going the right way and to keep going. Anyways, they met us at the top. Go watch that video from yesterday. So the monks are getting ready for their great debate. I want to know about those ch those uh, beads though that I have. Is there like one Om Mani Padme Hum per per beat? Mocha. This is mocha. Thank you. And the latte. Shut up. Shut up. Wow, this is awesome, Isn't that cool? Yeah. We're just reviewing some of the footage I shot today. What are these? Raisins and? On the Phantom. Let's see. Sora, there's this beggar lady outside that keeps talking to us and telling us to go like this. She wants money. She wants money. <laughs> Don't forget your water. So, we're just gonna say bye to our very good friends right here. Uh, hey, goat. Goat don't care. See you later, buddy. Good stuff, folks. Oh, you smell. Anyway, have a good one. Oh, now we're leaving. Going to the bus station. It's sad because Shiaha is awesome. If you ever come to Shiaha, stay at the Nirvana Hotel. Thank you so much for your hospitality. Yeah, thank you so much, Wendy. No problem. No problem. Okay. Thank you. Bro. Thank you. So you have a busy day. No, no, no. Soon it's coming. Big bus. Good. Very good. We are happy. We the place is very nice. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Let's go to the bus station. Thank you for Thank you. Okay. Nice Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. So what was your favorite part of Shaha? My favorite part of Shaha definitely the climbing, the meditation caves and, and the, the meditation caves. No man. The 
the nomad, yeah. samba, milk tea, <laughs> horse riding. Oh, you rode the horse? No, but almost. I rode a Honda motorbike. Yeah. <laughs> the guy was more fun just letting me that. Uh, letting me Ride that. He's like, horse? No. Motorbike? Right yeah. in between the ride, I said, oh yeah, and then he said, oh yeah. <laughs> Good guy. Yeah, I think she finished it. She said her wallet was stolen. What? Yeah. Oh. Her wallet was stolen. As long as passport is not there. Her, the passport's gone. There is no sarcasm in China. There's no sarcasm in China. <laughs> Don't scare me like that. She said she could see me, which is, which is a little creepy. So, so Lita right now has all of our tickets and we have to wait for her because she went to eat. And she said, I can see you. Oh, there she is. Shifu, Lanjo, Gong Jiao Zhe. Nigga one. Okay. There's no one on the bus yet. It's empty bus. Shifu, Lanjo ma. Lanjo. Huh? We may have the, the whole bus to ourselves here. They probably won't. You know what? That, this, this might not be good because if they don't have enough people, they may just not go. Is that possible? That's possible. How's that happen? That's very possible. Why are you freaking people? Okay. No, really. There's no sarcasm. Rwanda, no, 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 no. In Rwanda, even though there's an 11 o'clock bus, they, they wait until it's full to go. No way. Yeah. You remember when they go to Uganda? Mom? Yeah. The bus is to Uganda. And it's supposed that they say, oh, not enough people. Goodbye. No, normally they just wait for enough people. Because it's African time, you know what I mean? It's just, you know, yeah, yeah. mosey, mosey, mosey. <laughs> mosey, mosey. <laughs>